Hi, my name is Bruno. I'm here to talk about Turning Point. Well, it was a huge impact. Um, I didn't realize for the longest time that I did have a problem. I always um, heard from the wife that, you know, you she didn't come right out and say, you have a problem, you should be just slowing down a bit, you know, like it started off with, you know, having a case of beer on the weekend and then one beer after work during the week, never drinking during the week, but then one beer and then two beers and then uh, maybe 10 years along the way, it's, the beer wasn't enough for me and I turned to the hard stuff where I had to get that buzz and uh, because beer wasn't enough for me and uh, turned it into the hard stuff and then I started drinking on the job which wasn't just coming home from work and depending on it there and how to cope with every day and I had to have this and I turned to vodka because I always thought that you wouldn't smell vodka, right? Basically the wife knew, my wife knew that I had this problem. I started off with the AA, going to the meetings. I was sober probably for a couple months. It was helping but it didn't help uh, me that much because their program they want you there every day sort of thing and I really couldn't do that or didn't want to do it you know I tried right and uh, that was for a couple months and then three months after that or four months went by and I started into it again so I knew that AA wasn't going to help me out me myself not knowing what to expect when I got to Turning Point because Michelle, my wife, made this all up or organized everything for me, I just was totally surprised when I got there. Like, I didn't know what I was getting into. If it was going to be like guys walking around in white coats and stuff like that, I didn't know what I was getting into at all. I just pulled up and um, they greeted me with open arms, of course, the guys that were in the program at the time and the house sitters that were there was, you know, I sort of went, wow, what have I gotten myself into? But as it went along, it was all comfortable. They made me feel comfortable and met the guys, got along great. The one-on-ones that you have with your counselors there are uh, just amazing and the, and the things they teach you. The group sessions you have with all the guys that are there and the counselors and all the inputs and everything that everybody has, you get so much out of it because they teach you how to learn uh, to use your tools. The tools are the main thing that helped me, the house sitters. Uh, Butch is there was one and Ian was the other house sitter and they would look after the guys there. It would be like the, the home environment was the main thing that I really loved about the program. You do your own cooking, you look after yourself, you make your own bed, um, you, do, you clean up after yourself, you, and you do it for yourself, and everybody did that, but you become a family. And that is so important, like I said before, about going to AA is one thing, but getting into this family is, is totally different, and you're there day in and day out. Well, the, the sauna is, is another great thing. It's not, not nothing we look forward to every day going into the heat and everything, but to get the toxins and all that stuff that is in your system, doing the vitamin treatments, going into the sauna, and unbelievable what comes out of your system. It, it is unbelievable, and you wouldn't believe it until you see it. Uh, you just sweat so much, and, and all this crap is getting, you're detoxicating, you know, your body, and you can feel it day after day, hour after hour, actually, the, the, the crap that's coming out of your stomach, right, or out of your system. The support circle um, was very important to me, and I, I realized that after being here for two years, and my two years is almost up, and I've stayed on it two years straight, every month, I came to the support circle, which you go back and you discuss uh, how your life is now, any problems you have, any triggers that may, may occur, or what have you, um, because you go back to the counselor and you discuss this and you have your family members or your support circle, which you, your friends, close friends that support you in what you're going through. And you discuss all these things that, uh, are bothering you at this point 
you know, if there is any, or if there is any, which more than likely you're going to have problems, but you learn how to deal with them so much easier. And that's the support. Now I realize how straight my head is, how things come to me so much easier now compared to before, where if there is a problem, I can deal with it so much easier because I have that clear mind. Before you have a problem, you turn to the drink or you turn to whatever you abuse, right? But now it's everything is clear and the answers come so much easier to you. Uh, two boys that I have, if they have problems, they're actually coming to me now for answers because they know the clear mind that I have, which before it was like, why am I going to go to him? Why bother? You know, like he's only a drunk anyways. That's the way I was being looked at by my boys, you know, my family. So now they actually come to me for answers, which is a great feeling. The wife and I are like newlyweds again. It's totally amazing. It's just great. The boys, like it's a family again. It's like it, it was gone for so long, but I didn't realize it. But now, like with that clear mind, clear head, it's so beautiful. It's just great to have now in being straight.